Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 51 second round match between, oh wow this is amazing, it's the Slayer of Gdanik, it's Tachyon Speed and his Burts versus Kill Bill and a lovely human team. In the booth with me is Kalon G, hello! Hello Jim, so glad to be here man and what a lovely uh, hyped uh, atmosphere you've created. Uh, <laughs> yeah this is really exciting. Uh, nice re-roll on the kickoff for uh, Kill Bill. Lovely human team, as you said. Um, but yet, yeah, this is a, a pretty cool uh, Bretonian team. Uh, down a little bit TV. Uh, so, has the slight inducements, I believe. But um, Yeah, they've got a babe. They've got a babe. Cool. Um, but yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Uh, just saying before stream, um, really, really enjoyed the game between uh, Gdanik and uh, Tachyon Speed. If you haven't seen it yet uh, and you're watching this on YouTube, go give it a watch. Uh, really fascinating game. And uh, yeah, well, obviously, you know what, what happened. So I was about to say, I'm not going to give away spoilers. <laughs> but, well, one of them is still playing in Chalice and the other one isn't. So, uh, so there you go. Funny but, enough, um, this yeah, human cool. teams look like it'd been a much bigger challenge for Gdynik than the Burt's, right? All this yeah. mighty blow and tackle, pom, jump tackle. up. This yeah. would have been a real test for him in this round uh, if he'd it made really it. Would. <laughs> but he did. fell at the first hurdle. To he this did, unfortunately. Really unspectacular Burt team. Like, it's nice that he's got the, the two stat guys, right? He's got a blood yep. step with Arch, blood, blood step with strength. Yeah. And he's got this mighty bow tackler, but it's like it's still ropey. Like I'm still I'm still betting on the humans in this game, to be honest. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah. Um. I mean, you know, Bretonians kind of have a, a a ceiling limit of where they start becoming like, you know, saying something is a really good Bretonian team is like, you know, what's your favorite venereal disease? <laughs> <You know? laughs> it's it's not a high bar. Um. <laughs> but this is this is pretty great. Um. Looking forward to next season actually because I. In a little spoiler for you on YouTube, because we're watching on, I'm watching guys play on Twitch at the moment for this season. And uh, both, uh, so uh, Rick Reckless, uh, Crystal Hunter, and Andy Dave are all on the Bretonians this season. And uh, some of the teams that are coming through from those three guys are absolutely spectacular. So uh, make sure you're coming back and watching um, what happens to see which of those teams gets through. And uh, I, I promise you, you're going to be entertained by how good they are. Mm. Yeah, I hear that uh, Chunter had an incredible team, but uh, doesn't have yeah, a record. Yeah, just didn't. It didn't. Oh, and I think I, I think it, it may not it may no longer be uh, because the the record just kind of fell apart on him. He did have a strength four blodger and a strength five blodger, which is pretty cool. Wow. Yeah. Wow, yeah. But uh, strength five Bretonian Blitzer is pretty fucking awesome. It Although, is. does it lose in the thing when you have Dauntless? I mean, people say no. it, but it kind of doesn't. Strength no, it doesn't at all. I've had I had a Strength Five Bert once, and he was fucking glorious. Beautiful. <laughs> I thought you don't play Bretonians. What are you talking about? I don't anymore. Ah, uh, okay. But I am the greatest Bert coach of all time. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, fat Ooh, Earl. Diced. Oh, gonna be gravy all over the pitch there as well. <laughs> So, yeah, the speculative 4 plus dodge from the Bretonians. Uh, Oof, in a, look at that record. Yeah. Oof. No, I'm sad I lost to them once. Ugh, yuck. Yeah. Yuck. Yeah. Fuck it, I was absolutely comedy mega diced, by the way, in the loss to them. Sure. <laughs> Absolute comedy mega It wasn't even anybody in note as well, was it? No, it was like 30% or something. I just got yeah. shit on. <laughs> ah, blood bowl. Yep, that's, it's a dice game at the end of the day. I mean, it is, yeah. One of the reasons we play it, it's all fun and shits and giggles, isn't it? Mmm. But I enjoy it. Yeah. I enjoy, uh, I enjoy getting shit on. Get shit on! Yeah. I thought you were Irish, not German. Hey! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Your ass! Funk! Your ass! And there goes the DP. What you want me, bro? Pretty good news. <laughs> the uh, yeah. the mighty blow on that side, uh, looking after his buddy, the piling on lad, by uh, getting rid of the DP for him. Yeah. Gotcha, oh, fam. Oh, gotcha. God. So, already two men down the Burts this drive. Yeah. The, pe the shithead peasants, the worst linemen in the game. And I guess snotlings are worse, but pretty much mm. the worst linemen in the game. Mm. Getting shit on. Are snotlings worse? Maybe like, not. No, I think snotlings are pretty good, actually. They can kind of go do stuff. Oh, here's a fun thing we did over Christmas on the uh, Era Blood Bowl uh, uh, Discord. Uh, 
So we all made the same team exactly, and we all went into a 32-man competition uh, playing the same roster. And the roster is as follows. Um, you have 16 halflings. Uh, sorry, not halflings. 16 snotlings. Noblars. And all of the Noblars have uh, Mighty Blow, uh, Frenzy, and a niggling injury. <laughs> God. And... <laughs> <laughs> and you've got uh, three rerolls, and that's it. Oh, and we're, the, the new rule we put into it is you're playing on Astro, Astro Granite. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty great. And so, basically, somebody goes first. Uh, the first guy to roll a few POWs just, you know, just starts removing your team. Mm. But um, what's fun about it is that everybody, you're involved in every single turn because you've got Sidestep and they've got Frenzy. <laughs> so you're not kind of switched off at all, which is really fun. And it happens so quickly. Um, I do. I'm been trying to convince them to play it on one minute turns, but that might be a bit too much for them. Mm. But it's it, it's just stupid. It's just stupid. It doesn't matter what's going on. You can play as well as you want, but it's just down to who rolls who rolls more pals. Uh, but who cares? Because it's blood bowl and it's just shits and giggles. Mm. So it was really really fun. Interesting so, non, yeah. non follow there. I don't know. Mm. Super uh, interesting. I, he just really wants to keep that guy safe, I suppose. Yeah, I guess he's, I guess he thinks he's almost won the drive, right? So he just needs to uh, keep him, keep I mean, him back. Things are looking pretty good for him already. Um, it is yeah, turn. Exactly. Uh, it's into turn four. Turn four, four down two man. Yep. Already bad. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I, I should play it. <laughs> 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 Can you imagine Artemis playing with that? Oh man! Like, there's no way. There's no way. Like, uh, you, uh, to be fair, I mean, it's the the idea is that it's a bit of a palate cleanser from Blood Bowl because you cannot take it seriously because you're just going to get fucked. I mean, you can take it seriously, but then you're. I mean, you. If you do so, you're 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 opening yourself to a world of hurt. Yep, I mean, so, but you certainly can. Believe I can speak from experience. Yeah, okay, yeah, fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> you certainly can. <laughs> Here we go, rolling the dice now. He's got two. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, he does. He was already in a bit of trouble. It's a nice position for the fan, let alone having the good foul in. And it's a nice piece to foul as well. It's nothing. And uh, Hobgoblins are not worse than Ord Warriors. No, Hobgoblins are way better. Way, way, way better. Than, uh, way better than Peasants. Yeah, I would never ability, take part in Because ability Nobel. 3 is just, is just great. Yeah. Yeah, no, I would never take part in Noble either, Paravale. No, fuck that. Fuck that. You wouldn't take part in it. Oh no. yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Even though it's frivolous fun, um, yes, yes. I'm not frivolous. <laughs> so no, it's it's for it's for filthy casuals and fun havers. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I so thoroughly enjoyed it. I thought it was really really fun because um, mm. I don't care. Mm. Uh, which is a nice place to be about your blood ball, I think, where yep. you can both take it seriously and want to want to do it right and make the right decisions and enjoy everything that's going on, but also not care. Yes, I mean, that would be the ideal. Doesn't pile on. Yeah, unbelievable. Unbelievable decorum. Yeah, like Definitely really, really... Right uh, I, it, it was, but uh, it's just really um, uh, very disciplined by, uh, by Kill Bill. Mm. Love to have that Guardian as well, and do the last action, get the GFI in, because even the square that he would have fallen into was, uh, was good enough. Mm. So yeah, he seems really in control of the drive and has been making really, really nice decisions. So has Taki on speed, to be fair, but um, he's just under a lot of pressure oh, God. and likely to remain so. That's really rough. He hasn't had any dice. He's good. he's doing well to get out of here at nil nil at this half at the moment. I mean, that's the first reroll he's had to use, but uh, but yeah, he's in, he's in a bit of trouble. Mm. This is kind of cool. I had uh, I had fun when I played. Uh, oh yeah, lovely. He gets the potato. Yeah, really cool. Um, I had fun when I played Faulty in, in SFL last. Because <laughs> oh. you just completely ruined him. <laughs> no, neither of us played. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the perfect game of Blood Bowl. Yeah. Yeah, we just played out a one-one draw where neither of us neither of us mounted any defense whatsoever. <laughs> I get, I get tilted by my opponent having selected bad skills. <laughs> Yeah. I'm surprised you didn't dodge that. I would have dodged. I would have potatoed. Yeah, I would have potatoed yeah. the fuck away. One, two, yeah, three, four, good. five, six, seven. Maybe even GFI, so you get out of range mm -hmm. of this guy blitzing the you. Palmer, yeah. And then uh, you've got a chance to, like, you know, get it to him next turn. Yeah, hundred percent. 
because uh, then he has a, like he has a lot to worry about because it's either the pass on or the handoff to the agility five or even just a GFI to get him to him. Yeah, so yeah, he makes a lovely like lovely. Uh, he makes a lovely oh. potato. He's straight for bludge. Yeah, I hate this. I hate this reroll, right? Because you <clears> just <throat> take the ball down and assist with the catcher. Yeah. Hated that reroll. I want my reroll for smashing the shit out of this strength four guy. <laughs> Don't need it. Get him anyway. Whoops. Problem now is if you pile on, you're not you're not there to cover. Oh yeah, I don't like the pile on this time. Good discipline, well, previously. Yeah. But and all because it's also attempting him in as well by following. Like if you didn't follow there, you've got him back free, yeah. and this guy can run back to cover. Whereas now you've left yourself completely open down this side. So yep, yeah. I think bit of a misplay from mm. Kill Bill there. I did surprising. enjoy that game versus Dodd, yeah. <laughs> yeah, to be fair. Yeah, very surprising. Mm. He's, he's, he knows how to play Blood Bowl, does Kill Bill, but you know everyone makes mistakes, and I mean, in my opinion, that was a mistake. Uh, we have not uh, watched that game yet, Carla. Oh, no, we have, haven't we? Andy Davo's game. Uh, yeah, the halflings, the halflings are yeah, The halflings <laughs> are indeed all the way through to the third round. Yeah. Um, the third round. The third round, boy. Um, there's only one... Oh, no, they've got two turns left or something. Okay. okay, they've got two turns left. There's only one scoring threat, and he's only just in, but no. He's got two turns. Oh, wow, instant dub scores. Jesus. Hardly ideal. Mm -hmm. Gets the stun from it. Mm. The names are fucking hilarious. <laughs> Yeah, the poor old piling on lad is just kind of stuck. But uh, yeah. I suppose he's the blitz. Yeah, he's jump up. There we right. go. Uh, he piled on because he's got jumped up. That's the thing. But yeah, he's using the he's using the blitz, even though he's got jump up because he didn't he didn't want to risk rolling the one with no re rolls left. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. And you know, obviously, if he piled on and cast that guy, then there would have been space on for the other guy. But I just, I just didn't like it. Jeez, he went through the four re rolls there fairly quickly, didn't he? Yeah. Like the last four turns. It's amazing what can happen when you need rerolls <laughs> over <laughs> subsequent turns. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, oh. Skull. Well, I think as the birds, you just uh, you continue mm -hmm. to sideline cage. Um, yeah, it was a really interesting game. Uh, whoever it was that asked, uh, yeah, the the the, the halflings were um, the halflings played really well. Um, Davos' team is a bit shit. Uh, he was probably a little bit unlucky to not get more or better removals. But um, in the overall scheme of things, um, I thought the halflings played really well. Davos was a bit disinterested and a bit tilted. Mm. Uh, which is a shame, because, uh, you know, he's better than that. But uh, he, got, he, got, he got very annoyed. I mean, his team is uh, shit, sure. so... His team is shit. And he was expecting it to uh, be a lot easier because he was playing against halflings, and halflings are not an easy opponent. No, I think that was, I think that was a mistake if he was expecting it to be easy because I would have I would have definitely expected a hard game if I had that lizardman team versus a halfling team that had won the first round. <laughs> yeah. Yes, exactly. So uh, yeah, good point, Ducky. I suppose he may want to um, uh, have the edge available to go and. Uh, take it back I suppose. The problem is the edge 4 is the one you're going to blitz isn't it? It's the one you're going to want to blitz so yeah I would have definitely wanted to swap them as Ducky says but the problem is he's only got one reroll. He's, he's got a catch though hasn't he? He's got so, catch yeah. Yeah maybe he should have Maybe he should have got that onto the edge 4. Mm -hmm. Because this is the natural guy to want to blitz 100%. Yeah. Yeah. A great tag though on the tackler. Oh. Yeah look. Here we go. But still, it's an extra one in 36, isn't it? But yeah, I would have liked it because, yeah, there you go, he gets knocked down. Him. And now the ball is on the wrong is on the wrong elf, mm. as it were. Mm. Yoink. Yeah, much better to have the ball in edge four right now. Yeah. But, having said that, you know, um, mm. there's pros and cons. <laughs> Unfortunate, JFI fell. Um, are there any clever things to be done here? Probably. Uh, as a sidestep. Probably just a block and a blitz and yeah, fair a enough. dodge. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. He doesn't have to dodge even, does he, with the block and the blitz? If he gets um, the pound. Yeah. He doesn't get the pound. No. Hmm. Pretty tricky. Very tricky. Yeah. Betty wishes he had the ball in match four. Don't want to keep the labour the point, but uh, yeah, Ducky was Ducky was totally correct, wasn't he? This would be a three-two. He said it's a four-three. Uh, no, just rolls the no, dice anyway. Uh, about Ducky being correct. That's why yeah. I was only reading him in chat. Um, <laughs> yeah, well done. Uh, does get the four-three and uh, just rolls it anyway. And then he pops. Yeah. Perfect. Lovely. Perfect eight turn stall. Yeah. Never in doubt. <laughs> I mean, at least it, things didn't get worse. He got those two removals like almost instantly, mm -hmm. and then mm -hmm. then everything calmed down, didn't it? You know, it, it could have easily got, gone from bad. It could have easily gone from bad to worse with this, this human is. team. Lots of guard, yeah. mighty blow, tackle, piling on. So he got lucky, honestly, that it didn't get worse after losing those two initially. Um, and I think he got a bit lucky that uh, Kill Bill made that mistake of, of piling on. In my opinion, a mistake. Yeah. Uh, looks like he's fully uh, given him the um, respect that uh, Kill Bill deserves by uh, putting his side steppers on the line and mm. uh, making this very, very difficult for the one turn. It is a side step movement eight. Um, yeah. Ooh. I mean, geez. I said that, and then he. Yeah, this is weird, isn't it? The wings open. Did he run out of time? <laughs> I. That's really odd. I don't I mean, understand. Do this. That's maybe really he's, odd. Maybe he's getting. Maybe he's thinking against the riot. But even then, just like oh, because he doesn't want him to be able to blitz the side step forward, right? So that's why he doesn't want any mm. players here, mm. so that he can't run in and blitz them forward. Okay. But still, surely having people over here is better than just doing nothing. No, here. old no. Dobo. No. Favorite player. Wow. Well, there might be a one-turn chance here. Uh, I'm pretty sure there is. Oh. Well, we had other ideas. I don't know. Anyway, just pile this for large. Get Rex, son. Nah, nothing. You'll do nothing. <laughs> and he gets the rest there. So now we've got this guy, yeah. Yeah. So can we do some shenanigans? Are shenanigans available? I think just push him there and then use With the whole the method. Oh no, end. he's not doing that. Mm. Oh, he's just not trying. He's just not doing it. Oh, that's weird. That's weird, isn't it? Yeah. It's yeah, because really he could have pushed him back to there. Yeah. And then, nah, but then he's got side steps. I think I pushed him. Ah, I don't know. Maybe not, actually. Maybe it. Was it that hard? I don't think so. I think, I think it, it was, was pretty. Oh, I think it was pretty hard. Especially after huh. he'd done what he'd done. I okay. think it wasn't possible by then. But, uh, you know, I'm sure Cole could have done it. <laughs> I'm sure Cole could have done it and not many other people. Oh, fair enough. <clears throat> I'm just surprised Kill Bill's a pretty good coach, plays a lot of humans, has move eight sidestep. I'm really surprised he didn't go for it. I think that's, uh, especially with the defense the way it was. It's really hard, uh, really, really hard crazy. with two sidesteppers. It's really sure, hard but with I two sidesteppers. Sure, but I mean, but he could have, like, he still had the options there, though, when the uh, I don't think defender. he did. I don't think he okay. did. Okay. What's he need? Three pushes? Yeah, it, it wasn't possible. But like by the time he got to hit him, it just wasn't possible. Okay. I may be possible with like six plus dodges and stuff to fill in. Mhm. Mm which then isn't really worth it, probably. It might have been possible, I guess. Yeah, if you go in and like do a six plus dodge to get that one. Yeah. And then there, and then like more six plus dodges. Maybe it was possible I mean with a few six plus dodges. But then yeah, is it I, worth I mean, it? I, well, the thing was that I just I was surprised with the way he set up to do, to not have gone for it was the more of the issue than like because by the time it got to the end of it, which was you know where he I, I, he could definitely have got two more pushes. But that's not enough unless he's rolled some six buses. But prior to that, he could have done better blocks or better orders or better setup in order to accommodate for it. Maybe you have, have three done. minutes in. You have three minutes in Chalice as well. I mean, maybe he could have done. Maybe he couldn't. <laughs> It's not okay. easy, is it? It's not easy. I I think it's probably, yeah, as it does, it's just, just attrition. Just go for the attrition. Like, you know, they're, they're good players on mm. the OS. He's got Pommers. Just mm. the, the attrition is probably much more likely than, than you know, going for the, the very, very, very low one-turn chance. 
Mm. But then obviously if you, if you don't set up against the one turn, then the one turn becomes a pretty good chance, so it... Yeah. You know. I don't know. I, I imagine Dog to the Dog will be here in a while and... Dog to the Dog. Dog to the Dog. Dog to the Dog. Fuck's sake. I keep on putting Dog in there for no reason, and I <laughs> either put it in the first one or the second one. It, is that because you think he's got a spade in his head? Uh, <laughs> that's right, yeah. Because <laughs> I, I really like guys in uh, guys with peach faces and wearing cardigans. Mm -hmm. um, that was a great show, Doug. I used to enjoy that. Hmm. Fun for all the family. Hmm. I wonder if Tachyon Speed has um, has uh, fend on manual. I'm sure he doesn't, because he's uh, got a normal working brain. Yeah. Like a monster. <laughs> uh, no, Steve. The next time we'll see play Jim playing Blood Bowl is Sunday, playing uh, Tom Schnees in oh, baby. in uh, in SFL, SFL playoffs. Yeah, super exciting. And I don't know why I'll be playing Blood Bowl on February the twenty-first. <laughs> Are you not getting the pre-order? I, I certainly have not pre-ordered it, and okay. have no plans to hmm. pre-order or even purchase Blood Bowl 3. Oh, that's a shame. Mm. Uh, you're just going to wait to see what it looks like? Uh, just hope or if you get a free copy. I just hope that I will never have to play Blood Bowl ever again. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> well, as long as we still do this, right? Yeah, well, hopefully, but I mean that's yeah, probably not going to be in at launch. Is. Almost certainly won't be in at launch. We'll we'll see. We'll see. Of course, yes. It's not in now, and they said they hope mm. to add it by launch, which to me yeah. means there's no. no fucking chance of it being in at launch. Mm -hmm. You know. You know they hope it's in at launch in the same way as uh, PC hopes to have a torrid affair with Angelina Jolie. You know. You can, <laughs> you can hope for lots of things. Uh, I bought it for myself for Christmas, uh, Big Chi Chi. Um, well, my birthday actually it was the 29th, so I bought it for my birthday oh, for myself. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, me. Oh, thanks very much. Um, we're the same age, mm. so we're, we're both aware of uh, you know the answer to life, the universe, and everything. Mm. Um, but yeah. Uh, uh, I'm really excited for it. I'm looking forward to playing it. I'm looking forward to, you know, seeing how it works. And, um, yeah, it's going to be a really good good crack. Hmm. I'm also, one of the reasons I want to buy it early is because I want all of the stuff and I want all the expansions because I want all of the things because I like toys. And I'm a hobbyist and I want all of the stuff so that my guys can look, you know, I'm going to spend time making all of the outfits and stuff. And putting guys, oh, this guy's gonna have this shoulder pad and it's gonna be cool. And I'm gonna use, you know, lead belcher on this shoulder pad. And I'm gonna use, like, I'm gonna use my fist on red on this. And then I'm gonna highlight it with, uh, with, with Wild Rider Scarlet. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm into that because I'm a nerd. And yeah. uh, that's good. And if you're gonna spend that kind of amount of time on, on, on something, then uh, yeah. why not spend the bit extra and everything? This is exactly it. Yeah. Yeah. Too late, Paravel. You made a you made a spelling error. You fucking idiot! <laughs> <laughs> what, what a wanker! <laughs> oh wow, this guy's <laughs> fucking oh, dead. So much, Steve. Oh no, sorry. We'll go back to watching the game. I thought you dead, Jim. <laughs> uh, good apple though, at least. So that was nice. You wanted a nerve and a chicken. <laughs> <laughs> and in the midst of all that, Dirty Rascal, thank you very much for staying fantastic, absolutely glorious. Uh, that was fun. Oh my God. Yeah. That was nice and perfect. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty good. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited for it because uh, I am a total nerd and I'm really into the, the whole idea. Like, um, for years in, uh, which, what was the name of that? The uh, Dawn of War games? Mm. Yeah, he's getting banged out here, isn't he? Yep. Um, so, I mean, the, the overtime looks like the most likely thing. If he can keep the pressure uh, up, 
he's uh, he's going to be in a good position to um, maybe even consider going for it in uh, normal time. Hmm. That might be a bit too much to ask. But these uh, catchers are really annoying to deal with because he has to wrestle, but he doesn't have uh, any tackle. Mm. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Mr. Yemen Dem. You're not getting out so easy. <laughs> oh, there is a... I can decline gifts, though. <laughs> 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 I, I can decline gifts <laughs> so I can get out Mr. Yemen then but thank you very much I'll, I'll think about whether to decline it or not <laughs> did he actually just go and buy it for you? yeah lot of sounds yeah. <laughs> lovely fella really really generous well yeah. done yeah lovely fella thank you very much um. sorry Igralius is telling us we're wrong about our commentary because um, we should have been paying attention and uh, we haven't. Well, it's 10 v 10 on the pitch, but it, there's the quality players are out and they've been replaced yeah. by peasants. And they're down to 10. So it's... Uh... There you go. It's just when Negralius is looking at it, he's like, they're not blue, so they're not lizards, so they must be halflings. And they're all the same. Yeah. Sure, just but roll five three pluses them. and score, right? Yeah. Well, it's turn 12, though, somehow, already. Mm-hmm. Oh, look at this. Can you shoot a chain, guys? Getting his ball carry marked. Brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, not, not, not ideal. And uh, continues with the markage. I suppose he can always 2-plus off. I think that might be the plan now. I mean, he might as well take the hit first. Yeah, he's going to punch him. Yeah. Punch, punch, punch. Old Twitch Ooh. is dead. Ten men on the pitch, has he? Has he got ten men on the pitch? <laughs> 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 Fucking fool. <laughs> hmm. That is a very roundabout punch, I suppose. That it is, is three die. Weird, yeah. I would have just punched. He's got wrestling. You can just punch him and see and... if you... Oh, oh, wow. Yikes. Fend being overpowered. I mean, only if you fail to plan. Yeah. Seems and you know what they hard. say? If you fail to plan, you plan to fail. Oh, wow. That's, that's so deep. Mm. It's like, that's what uh, she said. Yeah. <laughs> making, a, making an ass of you and myself. Oh, no. God. I hate, yeah, I hate it when people say that. Yeah. But oh, you know what one really annoys me? Is when uh, you go, oh, great minds think alike. And somebody goes, fools seldom differ. Yep. Oh, look at this lovely chain. That's really, really nice. Do you shoot a chain, guys? Do you shoot a chain? Do everybody shoot a chain? <laughs> yeah, that one annoys me. Because, of course, the... Uh... Oh, he does have guard, but uh, he's only strength two. Yeah. And uh, he's got a wrestle hit, so it's totally worth it. Yeah, it was a one and three to just uh, have yeah. something happen. Just, just get on the ball. Uh, all of a sudden, this is looking pretty shit. He had a really nice uh, position, and then he blitzed all the way across the other side of the pitch and um, had to put a reroll into it. And now is uh, now now it's kind of shit. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? Like he's still he's still man up, but uh, mm -hmm. he's oh god, he's just a one of there. Gets the power though. Look a dog. Yeah, he's making a meal of it. It feels like he's making a meal of it rather than uh, being unlucky, you know? Yeah, yeah a little bit. <laughs> I mean, you know, all Lovely. of these stunts are obviously really fucking helpful. Yep. Um, I don't understand. Um, there was a... John J5 made a reference earlier about some guy who moved from side to side. And I didn't get the reference, but uh, yeah, the it, it this this is... Why does he, he keep on blitzing one side and then the other side? Why does he pick a side and go down it? Well, because he wants, he's probing, isn't he? He's probing, especially as the Burts have got less men. So, like, you know, he's hoping mm. that, that uh, Tachyon's speed will overcommit to one side and then he can burst through because he's got the speed, hasn't he? Movement 8-4. Yeah, move 8-4. So if, if Tachyon's speed, like, commits his blitzes or whatever, one side, mm. you know, leaves something a little bit open, he can he can scoot to the side. So, like, by, by switching sides like this and not really penetrating, you might, uh, you might open something up. Okay. Later. It's just it's just run short on time. And like, mm -hmm. oh, it's not great, but like you see, he's, he's always had this guy back, hasn't he, to cover any breakaways? So he can't make yeah, any breakaways. So and he hasn't been able to punch through. Pretty fucking awesome uh, safety. Mm. 
good point, Bill. <laughs> He's uh, yeah, he got a lovely couple of stuns. This uh, huge this stuns last half as well. Yeah, massive, especially with the um, the old Palmer went down. Yeah, and now he's got everyone based, well, nearly everyone based. So he's going to have to but do a one in nine trap, dodge. Trap yeah, trap space here. Oh, he's going for the sideline. He has to, and he has to do this dodge does, as well. Yeah, this, this is a big one in nine. Ooh. Yeah, and he feels fail it. Ooh. And here well we called. Well called, Jim. Mm. This, did this guy stand up? One, two, three, four, five, six. If he hadn't stood up, he probably should have geified first mm. to tag him. Mm hmm. Barry mm -hmm. Sanders. Yeah, yeah, that's it's better than more like a game of soccer, but Barry Sanders was incredible. Like Barry Sanders was incredible. He is the greatest running back of all time. I don't know why J5 doesn't like him. <laughs> Fair enough. Because what happens in American football is you have an offensive line which is five guys, five big guys, and a defensive line which is like, you know, four guys or whatever. And then the offensive line have to block these four guys, and then the runner, the running back, runs through the gaps. Right? That's what yes. happens. What happens with Barry Sanders was these four guys. You could imagine they replaced those four guys with like me and you and Johnny <laughs> Five, <laughs> and and then so Barry Sanders would have to run back, run for his fucking life with four guys chasing him, <laughs> run all around, then eventually like get you know five yards forward because he's a fucking monster. Who did he play for? The Detroit Lions, that's why. That's oh, why. wow, okay. That's why he had to do that, because they're shit. Right, yeah, because it's the... Well, yeah, that's a while back as well. Mm. Yeah, it is a while back. Well, Mighty Blow Lad's back in action. Yeah. Makes the GFI to tag that fella. But, of course, no edge four on the pitch, and uh, the thrower is back there, and uh, it's all a bit... Um, Tricky, yeah. Because uh, I mean, what's that? Is that his only scoring? No, he's it's got two turn scoring, fifteen. Right? Yeah, so he's got he's got turn the catcher, 15. he's yeah. got the blitzer, the and blitzer, he's got this and, the, line. and the the other blitzer as well. He's and just the line, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So four scoring threats, and this line as well, maybe. Ooh. No, not this line. Uh, no, I, I didn't know that he well, needed to do all of the... Okay. Yeah, he's, he's got to, he's, he's got to, he's out of the... Oh, because you're mastering four, okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, fair enough. But this is looking pretty strong for tacky on speed. Isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good point. That's, that's, the, that's the guy to stop there, is the, uh, is the thrower. Oh wow, obviously you got to reroll this, even though it's his yeah. last one. Is it his last one? No, it's not his last it, one. It, it, but, <laughs> is, <laughs> is it, yeah, no, neither is on one reroll. I thought one was on one reroll, I was completely wrong. Um, but yeah, has to reroll, obviously, because he's got a chance of winning in normal time, hasn't he? He does. Pops dodge, gets him in. Oh, baby, that's huge. Yeah, huge. Oh my god, that's really huge. Wow, there goes the Palmer. Yeah, that's... Well, he dead, wow. Jim. Yeah. He dead. Kill Bill might not even try to score now. <laughs> After that. No, he will, genuinely, uh, He will, obviously. But it's, this is genuinely hard. Oof. <laughs> genuinely hard. <laughs> Well, it's the wrestle down. Mm -hmm. So four plus three plus through. Yeah, four plus pick up and then four yeah. three. And then just four three. Yeah, oh. misses the four. Does have a reroll to put into it? Oh no, he doesn't. He used to dodge dodged. on that. I thought it was the tackler. Yeah. No, and that's all she wrote. That's it. Wow. Wow, the birds. <laughs> birds, <laughs> birds, man. <laughs> I mean, the first game, fair enough, they were worse than the best team in the tournament, but, like, they were a lot worse than these humans. They, and they somehow killed the best player and beat them 1-0, yeah. despite getting pretty much banged out for the whole game. They did get banged out for the whole game. And, uh, I mean, you know, uh, Kill Bill will be back. He's a really good player, um, knows his humans inside out. Uh, looking forward to seeing what he brings back next season. But um, was a bit at sixes and sevens, as they say in sporting terms. Yeah. Uh, throughout the... Um, throughout the second half 
Yeah. Yeah, unbelievable. Just again, you've got to say, just great play from Tachyon Speed, wasn't it? Just kept causing yes. problems. Yes, he did. Just kept getting in the way. Kept his uh, his, his his lad deep. Um, was always going to be able to go back over. And a pretty crucial uh, one in nine fails, to be fair, to not cover the back of the cage. But he should never really been in a position where he needed to fucking sideline cage. Mm -hmm. So, you know. Unbelievable. Um, mm -hmm. So there you go. Congratulations again to Tachyon Speed. Unbelievable, unbelievable run. Beats Danik and then Kill Bill. Commiserations to Kill Bill. Thank you very much, Kalon. Glorious having you in the booth again, as always. Yeah, cheers, man. Thanks for having me. And thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.